We're here on board one of Bowser's airships, cruising above the plains of the Mushroom Kingdom to a remote location deep in World 1. This unique landscape is home to a wide range of hostile wildlife across eight worlds, each distinct from, and more challenging than, the ones before. A vast history marks these lands with iconic landmarks all around. Just behind us are five starships borrowed from the Toad Brigade, holding the 16 strangers who will soon be cast away into this strange land. A wide range of life experiences. I work as a professional chef. I run my own restaurant. I'm sort of living in my mom's basement. I am a Dutch stand-up comedian. Perspectives. I'm 21 and I'm an environmental engineer. I do fuck all in my real life. You gotta have your, your stuff together. And the levels of maturity separate them. My occupation is female. I know how to have a conversation. I don't know how I ended up here. But they all share one thing in common. They are about to be left to fend for themselves in the elements of the Mushroom Kingdom. They must learn to adapt or they'll be voted out of the tribe. In the end, only one will remain to claim the million dollar prize. 39 days, 16 people, 1 survivor. First things first, everyone, welcome to Survivor. Woo! Yeah! Yeah! yeah. 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 Almost. Woo. Yes, sir! You 16 made it, and you're in for a 39 day adventure you'll never forget. So, I'm going to just start calling you guys out of your uh, ships. Once I call you, uh, go onto the big white platform right in front of you, and I'll tell you which drive to go on. Oh. So, everyone in the blue ship come out now. We got. Tim, Moy Boy, Billy, and Brian. <laughs> Tim and Moy Boy, you two go onto the green mat. While Brian and Billy, you two go onto the orange mat. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> How's it going? Name's Brian, I'm 17 years old, and I'm a plumbing prodigy. I'm, I'm not afraid to get dirty. I ain't afraid to get dirty at all. I guess fucking covered in shit by the day get paid the big bucks. Not really. I'm sort of living in my mom's basement, but we don't talk about that. Those of you who are in the purple ship That's come out. Oh, they wow, we, they we got double, we got a bup dad, and we got Joe. You guys are all on the orange strut. Orange! No. Cool. I'm double. I'm 16. Um, I'm just hoping... I can stay under the radar for most of the beginning of this game because some of these people are scary as hell. From the yellow oh, ship, no. we got Joey, no. we got Badgers, and we got Havoc. You guys are all gonna be on the green tribe. Hey, yo. Oh, yo. I'm Joey. I'm uh, I'm, uh, I'm a 16. I'm a recreation leader. I'm from Dallas. As far as strategy, make people laugh, crack a few jokes here and there, take a few shots of alcohol on, along the way, it should be a pretty easy win. You click a few buttons, you win immunity, you win the game. I, I don't see myself losing, really. So, uh, go Cowboys. Yeah. From the red mushroom, come on out. Kidmoto, Kimmy, and Knife, you guys are all gonna round out the orange stripe. Nice. Yeah. My name's Kid Moto. I'm 26. I'm a professional writer, and I work for the U.S. government. 
every single day I talk to people that have absolutely nothing in common with me. I'm talking 65 year old white straight het men that don't know what the fuck the difference between an Excel document and a Word document are. And so I think I can really carry those skills. And I think that's what makes me such a potent social player is that I know how to have a conversation. Your homophobic dad, I can talk to him about the Baltimore Ravens. Uh, your your gay 14 year old TikTok stand cousin, I can talk to them about the, you know, the latest trend, whatever dance is popular right now. Uh, here's your coffee, Mr. President. So it doesn't matter how old you are. It doesn't matter your background. I've got something that I can talk to you and connect with you on a deeper level. And that means from the green ship with Aussie, Electro, and Happy, you guys are going to round out the green tribe. What's up? My name is Electro. I'm 22 and I'm an environmental engineer. Uh, as an engineer, I work mostly with water projects, whether that be uh, hydrologic, stormwater, anything to do with water. So around the water is my home and where I work. Just like I use in my career, I'm going to create a new environment around me that helps others, and I'm going to use it to better myself in the game. I just ate my McDonald's breakfast, so I'm fueled and ready to play Survivor today. I'm going to try and play kind of like a hero, play a little bit loyal this game, try and get to the end. We'll see. All right, uh, on the orange tribe, you guys are going to be known as the Karibo tribe. Uh, we got Karibo. Yeah. Billy, Brian, Buff Dad, Double, Joe, Kimmy, Knife, and Kidmoto. Yeah. And then that means that on the green tribe, you guys will be known as Noko Noko. And you guys uh, have Aussie, Electro, Happy, Tim, Moy Boy, Havoc, Jacob, and Joey. So, we have our two tribes of debate. Uh, what time the better start the season with a big challenge? Oh, so, oh yeah. I need both tribes uh, with one captain. I'm sexy. Let's see. Brian? I'm a yep. bear. <laughs> Me? I want to do it. You want, you want to do 50 50? Yo, hey, rock, paper, scissors. Oh, let's do let's do I mean, if we make Brian do it, we can bully him if he loses. Right. <laughs> someone, someone, count someone count down for rock, paper, scissors. Oh. I got I got I got it. Um, one. one. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's smooth. Here we go. We have here. One. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. Joey, that so, was who are our captains? We got Tim for Noko Noko, and who's the Brian! Brian, yeah! Brian. yeah. <laughs> uh, my name's Tim. I'm 32 years old now. Uh, grown daughter, nine months old. Uh, I work as a professional chef. I run my own restaurant. I work with all sorts of people as a chef. So, for me, steering people around and getting people to be intimidated to listen to me is really new. So when it comes to a bunch of people I haven't met before, it's very easy to me because, you know, he's 32, he's old, he has a kid. Oh, he's cool. Look at that. He has a kid. Oh, I want to talk to him. Sure you do. At the end of the day, you're just blind about what's really trending. I'm not going to settle for 8th place, 6th place, the guy who everyone loves. It, it, it's time for me to finally close the fucking deal. Both the captains, I want you both to pick someone from the rest of your tribe that you think would be really a really good marksman. Jacob's being hyped up. I want to try. Huh? Oh, you, no, Billy, you want to try? No, Come on, Billy. Billy. Billy, you got yeah. this. So, I'm guessing Billy, for Karibo, we have Billy, and for Noko Noko, we have that, uh, Jacob? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, now, uh, I want the captains to both pick someone you think would be really good at parkour. Uh, okay, so put me in, coach. We have I think I'll... Kimmy for uh, Karibo and Joey for Noko Noko. Yep. If I lose to a girl, that would suck. Uh, <laughs> <the> Amazon. <laughs> I need the captains to pick one more person. I want you to pick someone that you think would be really good at a puzzle. Oh, oh, look at that bar. Oh, uh, yeah. So, doubles doing the puzzle for Karibo? Yeah. yeah. None of you feel comfortable? Right. We're the confident try. Let's go. Depends on what kind of puzzle. Right? Yeah, same here. Yeah. Havoc, just, just do it. Let's just do it. Havoc? Yeah. All right, fine. You got it. I believe.
For your first challenge of the game, you'll have to make choices across three stages, each of which your captain must complete alongside who they pick for that stage. The first stage is shooting. You will have the choice to shoot either buttons under a time limit, a button that's out of sight, or a wall full of buttons. The next stage is parkour. You can choose either the double neo, the ladder hang, or the five flock jump. The final stage is a puzzle. You can choose one of three puzzles, a logic puzzle, an alphabetizing puzzle, or a math puzzle. The first tribe to complete all three stages and have their captain place their banner at the front of the ship will win reward. Today, you were competing for an advantage in the first immunity challenge. Uh, no, uh -huh. mm. I thought this was shot. immunity. Let's right. go, Karibo! So, what? Ready? Oh. Go. Guys, go, 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 Make sure, you, make sure you pick an easy one. Oh, okay. go, go, go. Uh, uh, this one just right, can do it, I think. Uh, oh, I, I get an arrow. No, yeah, I don't have an arrow. No, 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 takes shooting the wall. Oh, I just take it. Alright. Up, up, up. Got this. Go. The timing's really messing up Billy and Brian. Oh, I got one through, but I missed. Oh, you nearly got this. Okay. Oh, nice, Billy. Think about it like monkeys on typewriters. It will, ju it will just keep going. Just, the, the more you shoot, the more likely you're gonna hit. One, <laughs> one shot left for the uh, for Karibo. Karibo! Oh, oh let's go! Go, 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 go! We have to break this, right? We have to break. Can you down? Uh, Ryan, you need to break. Get me out. Billy, you're good. No, go, no, go, me. Oh shit! I hate you. Get out oh. of here! Alright, we're doing double Neo. I, I hear the time of Neo. Oh, dude, the time of Neo. Brian decides, as soon as he finishes the archery, he sees three different parkours, and his singular brain cell just goes, Hmm, yes. Double Neo. I don't know what the fuck goes through his head, but he's the worst decision maker I have ever seen. Oh, oh go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Oh, wait, where's the hall? Go, 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 right, go, 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 Hey! Where's our, where's our wall? Joey, you're done. Which one do you want? Which one do you want? I'll do the fucking alpha part. Yeah, that's, that's right. that's you need to alpha die at 25. Come on, Brian. Once you take one, you're done. Thank you. I, uh, I didn't choose it. I, <laughs> like, I, I didn't. I didn't. I can't. Uh, the end. It's fine. Don't worry. Don't worry. Oh, I got it. What is that? That's the Alunia. That's M. No, okay. Um, right, let's go. Okay, let's go. 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 Red and yellow are primary colors. No um, color no borders. Color. It's so horizontally, but it can vertically. No, no color, color in the left column corresponding to the position of the ring. Alright. Did I accidentally just get it? Are we done? Uh, Double and Brian got it. Go, 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 Brian, go. Place the banner. Place the banner, Brian. Wait, oh, oh, we'll place it. First challenge. Gosh. <laughs> <Yeah. Woo>! <laughs> <laughs> so Somehow he clutched the puzzle, so if anything, he, he is arguably the dumbest genius I've ever met, which um, I don't know how to feel about that. Karibo, congratulations. You guys uh, win an advantage in the first immunity challenge, which you guys okay. will uh, see shortly. And... Looks like uh, the tone of the season set. That's <laughs> tough, Noko Noko, but you guys can head to your camps for the first time. So not ideal. I, I, I like to say that I can lead people to victory. That wasn't quite victory, but at the same time, uh, hopefully putting myself out there, trying to take charge on introducing people and whatever. You know, maybe people will appreciate that somewhat. <laughs> Fuck right, yeah, right. I'll just do this shit. Hi, uh, I'm Kid. One. I'm 26. I'm a professional writer, um, mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, I'm I'm happy to be here. I see some new peeps, which is always cool. And uh, yeah, 
it seems like the uh, the powers that be have have put my dumbass with uh, people who are more than competent at challenges. So I was a little nervous looking across the aisle, seeing some big muscles, seeing some big strong men. Hopefully, I uh, I can just do my thing. I can turn on the kid moto charm, lay a little bit low at first, because uh, this is always the scary part of the game for me. I'll go next. Hi. I'm MP Knife, aka Knife. I am 22 years old. I am from New Orleans, Louisiana. I work at a Applebee's. That is my job. Um, it is a very exciting job, and I'm just happy to be here with you all. Aww. Ooh, cool. Yay! Uh, I guess I'm next. Um, I'm Bub Dad. I'm 18 years old. I am a Dutch stand-up comedian, and Ooh. I am just oh, happy to be here. Down. Uh, well, I'm Bub Dad. I am a uh, Dutch stand-up comedian. <laughs> oh, um, usually how I think of my jokes is unironically while I am riding my bicycle, um, something just absolutely stupid just pops into my head. And somewhere along the way, a fucking joke just kind of forms it. Compost my ashes and plant some weed on me. Because then I might finally get blowed. <laughs> and I think that also kind of translates to how I am in game. At least what I'm trying to go for is just becoming friends with everyone by doing dumb shit. I think it's gonna work like a charm, at least I hope. Hi, I'm Kimmy. I'm 16. Hi, Kimmy. I'm from Illinois, and my occupation is probably getting shot tomorrow. So, oh my god! Yeah. <laughs> Yay! Uh, um, g'day everyone. Uh, I'm Sour Cream, but uh, you can call me Billy. Uh, 21 from Melbourne, Australia. Yo, what's up, everybody? I am Billy. I do a leap as personal assistant. I think people, pretty people, are just really attracted to me. Um, I think a lot of people are gonna underestimate this, yeah, how I do in this game. Uh, I'm here to play a winning game, you know? It's 1.07 a.m. currently for me in the morning. I'm not staying up to flop, I'm staying up to win. Uh, hello, I'm Joe, I'm 18. Uh, I am, funnily enough, the Queen's political advocate. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and nice, uh, nice. I was responsible in turning Downing Street into a circus. <laughs> nice. So many, so many well accomplished people on this tribe. With oh yeah. yeah. Deep political careers. <laughs> oh my. Let's go. I'm double. I'm 16. I'm a dress jazz trumpeteer. I'm double. I'm 16, and I'll play the trumpet. So I've been playing trumpet for like seven to eight years now, and the amount of time I had to keep practicing just so I can get better and do shit is um, longer than I can fucking remember. I was performing in a jazz band most recently. Playing Survivor is kind of like doing that performance. You gotta be self-conscious of what you do, how you sound, and a whole bunch of shit like that. And the one thing I learned from was there's no wrong notes in jazz. So how's it going everybody? The name is Brian, I'm 17 years old and uh, I'm currently a plumber. So I, I, I go in the pipes and I clean that shit out, you know? Ooh. And uh, Ooh. I hope we can uh, win this season. Yes sir, we got yeah. this. Yeah. Bro, yeah. Plumber right. on the Mario season? Bro, oh, I, 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 I forgot the season was Mario, oh, so I applied as a Can plumber. I take a peek at the plumber's <laughs> crack? <laughs> So that first challenge was, hey, I was the only one that did decently well in my part. And there was a whole thing between who between Tim and I would be the captain. And I think it kind of worked out perfectly. I was willing to be the captain and show that I wanted to lead this tribe. None of the blame is on me. Tim looks like a silly head and looks like a bad leader. Everyone else thinks Havoc doesn't do well with puzzles. So I think I'm in a very good spot right now. I think we did it! Accomplishment! Yeah. We're so good at the survivor's club. I mean. <laughs> so I'm guessing this is all supposed to be Mario inspired with like the tunnels. Yeah. Nah, yeah, I don't think so. Nah, nah. 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 nah, Sonic, Sonic. Yeah, yeah. Sonic. that's what it is. There's a few quiet people here. Uh, Havoc and I have already been chatting a small bit. Uh, it seems to be that me and him are probably going to try and link up. And besides that, there's, there's 
like loud people and then there's moy boy like degrading himself because he's young and like that's just gonna work out very wrong yeah i'm, I'm just excited to be here honestly i've never been in one of these recorded survivors and I've, that's always been my goal so i'm at least happy to be here but i'm the only non-adult on this tribe what I feel kind of screwed here, given the fact that I'm 14, and the, uh, the next youngest person is 18. I'm still like, how did I oh, even fuck. end up here? With like... Ow. Ow. With like, like, these like, veterans and people, I'm still like, amazed at it. I don't know why I'm here. Kind of sold, is that what you're trying to say? You know, we're, we're all looking around a tribe, right? And I, I see Havi jump in, up into this tree, and he, he stops for a quick second, you know, he looks down, and then he just kind of moves along. So I, I was like, you know, I'm gonna go see, I'm gonna go check, and when I go up on the tree, I see a fucking shulker box, and I see a dude run away. I'm like, no shot. So, uh, I'm pretty sure Havi has Yano right now. This game's already getting off to a, you know, an interesting start. Yeah, that's right. My name is Havi, son. I'm a naval officer in training, you know. Training up to become like a Navy SEAL, you know, I want to shoot bad people. And like, they always, they taught us, always point the gun down the range. You know, we gotta be, we gotta be serious with the weapons and shit. And like, I'm about to play this game, I'm gonna take charge. Uh, I might not, <laughs> I might not want to let them know what I do in my real life because they might, they might scare some people, yeah? But like, yeah, I'm gonna try to take charge of this tribe and we're gonna win. But, I've never really been too good at finding, at finding stuff in, in Survivor. I do some little parkour on the little cactus and stuff. I hop on the tree, I see a shulker box. It's got a book in it. It's a clue to the idol. I found, or I see a bunch of people looking in the absolute wrong spot. I know where it is. It's, it's said that it's in the sight lines of all these little statues over here. Of course. Oh, I don't know what these like, like statue things are. Like the, uh, those are the chaos emeralds. Oh, they're, they're the, the, the little skull turtle guys. Thing. Oh, what are they called? They're the fucking uh, drive bro. Drive, drive, yeah. Drive, yeah. Drive, uh, yeah. I will make the greatest house ever. Trust me. Yeah. I'll make I'll make beds for all of us. Oh, I mean, sweet. All beds here and all so basically, this tribe. I don't I don't really like it that much. They're just talking about Mario games, Super Mario 64, Super Mario Paper, or something like that. I don't know. I'm an athletic person. That that's like the complete opposite of someone who plays video games. But, you know, I'm using my personality to, you know, what fits these people, you know, gotta, I gotta shape the clay here to what they see best and, you know, gotta fit in. Y'all wanna build something? Dirt. Yeah, yeah I, I have yeah. lots of room to build shit. Goomba. <laughs> that Goomba. You gotta watch the Super Mario Brothers Super Show. Right, so You're gonna turn into a Goomba. I feel like we need a lot of dirt. So I'm just gonna get a lot of dirt. Oh yes, we are we are dirt. Oh hey, yeah, we took shit. Hi, hi. Do you mind do you mind if I sit right here? Not at all. Not at all. <laughs> Not at all. Enjoying the view. Wait, I wonder what I like this view. Yeah. It kinda reminds me of something. I don't know why. What what does it remind you of? Oh oh why. I actually So coming into this game, first thing I said, I don't mind playing a big game. But the first thing that happens in the season is I instantly get nominated as tribe captain. Um, I didn't want that. I was sort of pressured into it. I'm not entirely sure where I stand. Obviously, we have yet to go to tribal council or do anything of importance. So this is just pure theory. Oh, guys, I got stone. I'm getting very lost again. I'm on top no. of the trees. No. Oh, you get? that's the torch boundary. I found it. <laughs> There is an oh, epic I'll show GPA feature. Okay, I've seen another. I don't one. know. I don't know. It's pretty. Yeah, just look for the torches, honestly. So uh, I found a box at the bottom of the water and um, a shulker box. I picked. It was empty, but I picked it up. We go back to the water, and uh, Joe is like, "Yo, there was a shulker box here," and I'm like, "Wait a second. He's acting like it's still there." Did I just find out who got, you know, an idol? There was something that perplexed me since the first day, I guess you could say. I was just wandering around and I walked in, I found this little pond area, you know, chilling. And so I see a shulker box uh, and, and I'm like, okay, something's going on. Immediately I go to that shulker box and it's empty. But since the shulker box was empty, I sort of 
studied what was going on at camp, what that people were doing at the time. And there were two people that I saw were missing, Kimmy and Kid. I'm feeling like Kid has something in his pocket. I think out of everyone to go to that area, I think he's most likely to be there. One of them has something, that's all I've gotta say. I ended up finding the idol. <laughs> and yes, it's a Goomba. And just like normal, the idol will expire at the final five travel council. So I'm very excited, like coming into this game, like having that little bit of safety that just in case I do need to use it. I feel like I don't really kind of fit in with my tribe. So I'm just going to try and like try not to stick out, win as many challenges as possible, prove to my team that I am a strong person to keep around for challenges. Wait, no, you I broke think Hello. Oh. Yeah, you broke it. Hello. Yeah, you see me. Fix it. Fix it. Yo, what oh. are they doing? I'm trying to fix you it. Can't stop. Why would you break it? Wait, what happened? He doesn't look angry anymore. He just looks indifferent. Yeah. <laughs> Final boss already. Oh, yeah. oh, oh my god. Yo, that's cool. Oh my god. god. Is, that, oh, wow. is that the Tower of London? Wow, so who we find? Everyone, welcome to your first uh, tribal immunity challenge. Um, yeah. Woo! One of the most common sites in the Mushroom Kingdom are Bowser's Towers. Today, you'll be scaling one of them. To start off, two players will stand on pressure plates, extending blocks for a third player to jump up on and get over a wall. Kiribo, your advantage lets you have the first two of these already extended. Once your tribe reaches the top of the wall, the fourth player will be released to solve a rail puzzle, where they must make a continuous path of rails while covering every concrete block. After you've been checked, your fifth member, in a minecart, will be released, and they will ride in a circle until they've flipped all 22 levers above them to release your sixth and seventh members, who will complete a short parkour course. Once both members have reached the top of the tower, they will release your eighth and final member, who will tear down your opposing tribe's flag. The last tribe with the flag still flying wins immunity. This is your immunity idol. As long as your tribe has this, you cannot be voted out. Now, let's get to the challenge. Survivors ready? Go. Yes. Alright. All right. I think Woo! we need to find the All first right. jump. Alright, yeah. we got the first two. Um, right. oh, shit, we gotta find our first one. Right. No, first one, I like right. first one first. The second one's right here. The second one I'm looking at right now. It's the one that yeah, I'm, Ozzy, I'm looking at right now. Keep looking about that. Yeah. Keep looking. Ozzy, I think, it's right here. It's right here. It's right here. It's right here. Yeah. There you go. Next one. Yeah. I need this one here. Oh, shit. There you go. All right. Hey, I'm going to get both of them. So go to that one right there. See where I'm punching? I think it's your left butt, Dad. I think it was uh. Can I get it? Yeah, yeah. This one, maybe? Uh, no, 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 really? definitely no. not. You're good, you're good. We got, we got so much time. Work. We got so yeah, much time. Yeah, that's what I said. That's it. Ah. Yeah, got it. I have to go down here, and now I have to move back. Maybe there's so, like, hey, uh, but right. daddy, it's I don't, like I don't that think one right there, there, like, in this row, three like, in front of me. All the way Wait, down. Oh, stay, okay, yeah, yeah. I know you are. That was happening to me before, too. Okay, What? what's the next one? The one up? I do not know. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Wait, count it. Alright. Your feet is very slippery, Jacob. No, it's not. Oh, hold on. No, 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 no. Yeah. Right, got, sorry, no, you gotta, no, like, let me go. Yeah, back. sorry, I'm bad. My bad, my bad. bad. Alright, time and time. There you go. Wait, 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 wait. It's three. that one. Yup. It is. Yep. Let's go. This one's kid. It's below me. Below me, below me. Alright, let's go. Done. Oh, good job, Buff Dad. Good job, Buff Dad. I hit him. No, not yet. Yeah, all right. You're on it. We're good. Get go to wait, wait. No, I don't. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. Now I'm picking up the rails. I got it. I got it. Okay, you got it. You got it. Okay, we're good. Oh, it's broken. It's broken. Double. It's on it. Oh, yeah. I can't go into a curve. Yep. <laughs> it's an unironic twist of fate. Dude. Wow. Yeah. Oh, can't do that. Alright. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> yeah, right. Don't go until I say I'm on it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, not what I want. Double is working very methodically. Yeah, we just gotta take our time now. The, you mean the puzzle master. Get mm -hmm. it right. Yeah. Oh, there it is. Come on it. Alright, we're on. No good. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
And I like one. All right, Jacob, your time here is done. Joey, okay. I have to start use all the puzzle. Wow. Yeah, yeah, we, 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 you don't have to use all the rails. Just make sure that it makes it into its path. Yo, Joey, Brian, that hat looks ugly on your gun. You have this first part down, that's for sure. <laughs> no, this isn't allowed, JP. I can't do that. Uh, what? You can not do, do that, that. no. If people are going to do hard parkour, there has to be checkpoints. I don't understand why people don't do not hard. Is it hard parkour or is it bad points? <laughs> that shit is not easy. Uh, double, double. Loop back or, uh, use this path right here. Oh, damn it. There is a can, very uh, good come out here. Can come out Brian, here. Coach Brian. Oh, wait. Never mind. Never mind. Brian never mind, is coaching bro. double on how to look through glass. So, <laughs> <laughs> that's the thing. I wasn't looking through the glass. Yeah. Good old dubs. Good old dubs. I'm just doing? gonna look off of his. I'm just gonna look off that of his. That is good. Yeah. Noko, Noko, let's go. Move on. There you go. There you go. Let's go, Happy. Let me through. Let me through. Happy train. Let's go. <laughs> Yo, we I'm so, train. so slow. I'm so no. slow. Right. It's behind me. It's oh, let's go. Let's go. Happy, you got 22 levers. You need to flip all of them to let the next two people out. Wait, he has oh, a big axe? Are you kidding me? What the fuck? No, this is after. This is after. Wow. This is like the final cool? challenge in any seat, like in the challenge, dude. <laughs> if you think you're one short, you can shave one off because. Actually, I don't want praise from Brian. That's a bad thing. Ooh. Two left for Happy. One left for Happy. Let's go. Come on. I'm done. Tim I'm done. I'm done. Go, go, go. I double it, so bro. Happy, go. I, I got it, I got it, I got it. Wait, how are you supposed to get it? Oh, y'all broke here. Oh, 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 That's it. What the fuck, hold up. What the fuck? What is this? What is this? Uh, I can't even fuck with you. Just jump. Man. Just jump, man. Just jump. Man. Just just jump. Man. Let's go, baby. <laughs> If you, start, if, you, if you start in the back, there's Got a knife. Go on, knife. Push, 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 push. Play push, 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 push my ass. Push my ass. Alright, alright. Knife, you have 22 levers to flip. I want to get a one. What's going on? What the? Yo, Brian. Brian. You got this, man. Fuck you. There's even more parkour. Oh, I didn't know it would break down. Oh, MG. Come on, come on, knife. You'll know you're done with Close the first four once you made it to the okay, top of the tower. It just one whale. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. How did you get over here, Joey? Uh, he broke a hole. I broke a hole. Oh my god, that's fucking it. Oh, no, no, no. why, why is there a head hitter? Nice, you got, you got it, man. You got it, dude. You got it. Yo, I believe in you, man. No, I believe in knife. Well, oh, I'm I'm What's happening? Oh, okay, I'm Happy is still having the time of his life. Hey, what's happening? Oh, okay, I'm I'm Happy is still having the time of his life. Yeah, I've been here for like five minutes. Oh, I'm up. Oh, oh. Try standing still. Wait, 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 wait. It's blown. Stand there. Okay, let's go. Oh, yeah. You got this. Hey, let's go. Let's oh, go. There you go. There you go. Let's okay, go. No, jump team. up. You don't have to hook. Don't have, okay, there you go. Now to your left. You see the the stone. The, right. the yeah. roof of where I'm looking. There's a man hitter coming up, yeah. so watch out for that. Oh, you, don't, you, don't, you, don't, you, don't, you don't have to keep oh, jumping. Yeah. You just flip the stash. I got it. Joe makes stuff. Nice. Joe, nice. Clean that stupid block and that ladder was there in front of me. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Pop off. Karibo's on the last one. Go on, Billy. Go, Karibo. Looks like Billy's going to make some shoes. Basically, what you need is a uh, crafting go. table go, to pickaxe, uh, to stone, to stone pickaxe, to furnace, to iron. Yeah. A cool plan. Yeah. No, you no, got this. No, 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 no. The one on the right. <laughs> the one on the right. No one likes their coopers. He, he, starts, he starts tearing down our cool flag. <laughs> the wrong flag, please. <laughs> yeah. but this just we're gives okay. me anxiety. Okay. Okay. You're playing with fire. Jesus. I can't see what's going on up there. I'm ready to get the end. <laughs> There's two blocks tower, basically, the basically, the flag is hanging over high. the You're edge of the tower, so no if he takes the block beneath him, he falls. Wait, can I see you guys from there? You've got five more. Five more. You got Four. this. Three. Three. Four. No! no. no. Billy! Billy! Yeah, big, oh, big oh, flag. This chat is over. Karibo wins the first of the Yes! Let's go! Who wants to come up and get the idol? Can I? Double. There you go. Congratulations. Yeah. 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 You guys have won the first minute of the season.
the next Noka generation. Noka, I'll be seeing you guys tonight, and one of you will be the first person voted out of Survivor. Uh, you can go games. figure out who that's going to be. First immunity challenge, Dub. Feels nice. And honestly, I can't help but feel like I sort of was dead weight. Bro, I felt like I did so bad there. But I don't think anyone's really going to pin that on me because, you know, I, I did it in the end and I did it first. So I, I'm better than everyone else, obviously. Well, I feel like I'm putting myself as a target. I, I don't know why. I just feel like... I chose uh, the, the, the destroying the flag. I feel like I've I showed myself that I'm not really confident in myself, and I don't want to show weakness to others, but it's just really hard. All right, so the challenge, uh, you know, it, it went uh, early on. I, I think uh, my group did good. You know, I choked a, I choked a few jumps. It's all right though. Electro, Electro was taking his time. Uh, Joey smashed it, and uh, I mean, no offense to Havoc, he definitely did struggle on his part, but I don't want to blame him. Uh, right now, the vote's gonna be most likely Moy Boy. I mean, no offense to the guy, but like, he's just been, you know, kind of quiet. Hasn't really done too much. I mean, it's early. Yeah, that oh, was unnecessarily difficult. Yeah. I don't understand why. I wouldn't feel right like anyone's putting off people because of the first challenge performances. That just feels mean. It just right. sucks since I like everyone here. Yeah. No, I like that try. We should be one. And uh, like, <laughs> normally you can at least have someone to point to. Like, it, it can't really be this easy. I mean, it feels like it is, but I just feel bad for the kid. He obviously just doesn't know how to, like, integrate, I guess. It, it just feels like he doesn't want to be here, almost. He just came into the call, like, I, I, I feel like people are going to target me because of my age. I feel bad, and unless this is, like, some 100 IQ play, I'm going to look real stupid after this, but, you know, already before the challenge, me, Havoc, uh, Badgers and Joey were like, okay, uh, the gang that did all the opening challenges, that's just the gang for now, and we're gonna roll with that. And you know, that, that sort of worked out, and then like Aussie's included in that. I'm feeling good. I've had... My strategy was really... <laughs> if people threw my fucking segment on the bus, I was gonna say Badger couldn't make a full block jump, or Electro couldn't communicate, but I definitely, once I heard Hoi Boy was the target, I was like... I was like to them, you know what, we communicated fantastically, you know, we were great. I'm not ever going to throw you guys out of the bus, that'd be a scummy thing to do. No, I think that our tribe's pretty good. I, yeah. I know, it's just, we've had some weak spots. That's, yeah. It's, it's unfortunate, but I think it's just coming together and being strong, as far as I'm concerned. Maybe there's more than that, I don't know. But as far as yeah. I'm concerned, it's probably just about strength or something. Yeah. As far as I'm concerned, Moy Boy's put himself in a position to where people find him expendable and not really wanting to work with him because he isn't throwing out names and that's really sketchy. And I was in a call with people and they were like, hey, let's go for Moy Boy. I'm like, hey, as long as it's not me, I don't care. Yeah. Especially since we're still early. I mean, hopefully. Now. It's about strength, this vote. <laughs> yeah, right. I'll show that we can... I mean, Alexa, you show that you can step on pressure plates. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, good. The best I you can, can yeah. jump. I, I, can place, sometimes. I can place rails and happy. You can flick levers, so I think that's, that's pretty dominant. That's, that's pretty skillful that's, right that's, there. This is a dominant team right here. <laughs> but Alexa, yeah. you did show great communication with big man odds. Oh, man, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> I should be basically guaranteed to be safe tonight because everyone's agreeing that Boy Boy's going home. You know? I mean, he's not exactly the most confident individual. I think I think just after we take them out, like the whole tribe will be able to concentrate a lot more. And like yeah, once he once he's out, we should, we should have a lot more focus. Everyone's just gonna <laughs> okay. What's up, Electro? It wasn't yeah, obvious no, no. enough. Are you kidding me? Oh my god! <laughs> hey, I'm, I'm coming. I'm coming. Oh, 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 you guys have a, you guys have a name or something? I'm not really too sure. No, oh, I heard yeah, Brian. Each of you is a lit torch, which represents fire, because in this game, fire represents your life, and when your flame is gone, so are you. Hey, welcome to your first uh, tribal council of the season. Um, Hello. 
Yeah, it was a close challenge at points. You guys pulled ahead, but in the end, you just kind of choked on the parkour. Havoc, do you think that Thanks, it'd be dude. right for people <laughs> to uh, kind of blame you for that challenge loss? I mean, I'm not saying there's people <laughs> that aren't that are saying that. It's, but like, I do think it could be fair because like that part, but like that parkour was like stupid. Like I. <laughs> I've never seen, or I've never really like seen, or even done like any uh, t style of that parkour. Well, then speaking of challenge losses, uh, Tim, in the first challenge, you stepped up to be the captain. Uh, even though you guys didn't win, uh, do you still kind of accept that role as uh, almost a figurehead of the tribe, or uh, do you just oh. like kind of want that to be oh. a one-time thing? I, I I wanted to like prove a point. By taking up the first challenge, I wanted to make sure that nobody else had to. I don't want to enforce myself to be anything. I want people, if people look at me that way, then, you know, that, that's great. It's not what I'm asking them to do. Uh, well then, speaking of kind of perceptions and how the tribe can see you, Moy Boy, you are the youngest person on this tribe, I believe. Uh, do you think people might look down on you because of your age? Or do you think that's just something else, like just something about you that people just can accept? I mean, at first I felt like it might have been something detrimental to me, but if you're talking to some people, I feel better about it. You know, I, I've just been feeling worried. I, I could be out, I, like, I could be, like, singled out because of that, but I feel a bit better about it now. Aussie, like, do you think this is a good tribe? Like, do you think everyone just is kind of disappointed, and, like, you all were Harmonious 8? I think it's it's disappointing in the sense that both challenges were close, and I don't think there's really much you can pinpoint on people. It's been a hard process. It's always a hard process going to the first tribal. There's a little bit of a somber under somber undertone, and I feel, but I still feel like there's been some good conversations going on as a group. I do feel like everyone likes each other at a base level which does make this uh, trouble really tricky, especially being the first one. With that, I think it's time for us to cast the votes. So you're going to follow the red carpet behind me up onto the platform over there. Aussie, uh, you can go cast the first vote. Yeah, go cast hey. it. So you can go. Yeah. bit too young to be out here go on and play with your legos adios <laughs> <laughs>
I feel like it's my fault. I should have been more confident and I was able to be easy out. I just had a name. But happy I'm on the show. I got on the show. Love everyone on my team. Uh, good luck and goodbye.